Right. Eron Hatchet, more known as Norway Havoc, taking on the big man, Crawl the Death Stalker. My name's Sly. Joining me once again, I've got Jingus. Hi, everybody. As you could clearly see, I got out of there as soon as possible. I didn't want to be caught between these two guys. <laughs> big Crawl goes out to the floor. Ashley just sort of telling the man, hey, you look kind of sexy there. Well, <laughs> Norway tried to come in for a sneak attack, got clotheslined straight onto the concrete. Big man Crow just blindsided the man while like, Ashley was sitting there flirting with him. Um, sure, if you say so. Crawl, you're trying to choke slam Iran or Norway onto the concrete. But <laughs> nope. Norway went low to the Gronular region there. Yeah, folks, once again, Jingus is taking us to the Gronular region, and <laughs> Norway is going up top. But Crawl caught him, setting him up here for an overhead belly to belly suplex, spiked him. And Eron rolls straight out to the floor. It's not Eron, he's Norway, man. You gotta start calling him by the right okay. name. Norway, Norway Havoc. Norway Havoc, get it right or the man will co-cock you with a chair just like Slacker J. Well, I hope not. That hurt a lot from what I can remember of it. <laughs> anyway. That was sort of fun to watch though, wasn't it? Hey. I want to remind everyone, got a big 4th of July spectacular going on this Friday night. Friday, July the 4th, where we're going to be at, Jesus. We're going to be in Madison. Harris That's Street. where we're going to be. I'll let you talk later. We're going to be at 110 Harris Street, Madison, Tennessee, behind Pew's Drugstore. Everybody want to come out and enjoy the show. Got a big cookout going to happen at the show, too. We're going to have barbecue. We're going to have hot dogs. We're going to have some hamburgers. We're going to have some fun, man. Absolutely. In the ring there, Norway looked like he was calling for a test of strength against Kroll. That is not a smart decision. Oh, Norway's got more power than you give him credit for. Yeah, look, there's a... Kroll is about twice the size of Norway, literally, and he's just shoving the man off here as if it was nothing. Well, you have a point. <laughs> yeah, I think I do. Norway's got the... Well, no, Norway didn't have the best of him there, did he? Norway didn't have much of anything. He had an elbow to the ear is what he had coming off. Norway goes for a sunset flip. Kroll's having none of it. Tries to sit down, but no water in the pool. <laughs> Norway's name almost became no more right there. Norway would have been corpse there. Now taking slamming Kroll into the turnbuckle so hard, he pops part of that mask open. This is where Norway shows his finer part. The man's got intelligence. Sometimes it takes more than just brawn to win a match in the ring. And he's showing everybody just how smart he is. For example, Ashley Lachey Nori's girl on the outside there going for a choke with that uh, the cast of her she's got. I think she was asking him to sign that cast. Um, right. Thumbs up to that one, Sly. Anyway, Nori draping his uh, crawl's throat straight across the top rope there. That's right. Nori's showing that the brains over the brawn once again. I tell you what, Nori's got this man on the ropes. Literally right there, didn't he? Yeah, this is a street fight here, and both of these guys sure to taking it out to the concrete, slamming him onto the the desk over there by where Tony's sitting. Slamming the head of Crawl into that desk. That's got to be hard for Tony to see one of his best friends being beaten up by a man who he thought until recently was another one of his best friends, and shooting Crawl head first into the pole. Well, that's the thing about these street fights. Anything goes, and you see what's going on right now. He's got him a chair out there. He's fixing to use that chair to his best advantage. Maybe going for a drop toe hold or something similar into the chair. I don't know. Slamming Crawl onto the apron now as well. You know, Crawl back in his Death Stalker gear. He's left his clown days behind. But Crawl reverses it and sends Nora head first into that chair. Aaron, what is going on? No, Ray, excuse me. What is going on with you out there? Norway is getting the crap beat out of him. That's I'm what's going watch on. Watch it. I'm going to get the crap beat out of me if I can start calling him Norway. Indeed. Crawl now got Norway exactly where he wants him, but gets reversed, thrown into the pole once again. Once again, Norway showing that he's a little bit smarter than the big clown. He throws him into that steel out there. Hey getting now. him back up in the ring now. Now, Crawl, he's been hitting the head so many times, that mask has been completely ripped off. Norway doesn't care about that mask. Norway cares about one thing, and that's winning this match. Very much so. Norway is 
I don't know what happened to the man. I don't know what happened. And, and Nore showing strength here, body slamming the big man. You're talking about the power of Kroll. Look at the power of Nore. He just did that casually, like it wasn't anything. I'm amazed. Now Nore, he's going to show this man what he's made of right here. Rocking him with a big punch right there. Playing to the fans now. And another one. Can't seem to knock the big man that down, however. Knocking him back into the ropes instead. Taking him, shooting him off, and a big boot. Crow catches him, sends Nori down. Nori better get back up. I don't know what's what's wrong with him right now, other than the fact that he just ate that big size 17 shoot. Very much so. Devon Day into the ring now, attacking Crow from behind. Nori has got this entire stable of guys he can call on for help. Uh oh. Cole's not feeling any pain at this point. Devon better look out. Got him set up for a choke slam, but immediately Nori is up to help his man out. Nori ain't gonna have none of that. He's not gonna let this big man beat him, his guy up. Cole's not having none of that either. Grabbing him by the throat, setting him up, but oh, here comes Devon once again. It's where the backup plan comes into play. Very much so. It's not just Nori, it's Nori and Devon and Ashley Lachey and any 27 other guys he wants to bring into it. But now finally, Devon eats a choke slam for his efforts. Yeah, but it's not Devon that's gonna have to pin. He's gotta pin Norway. He needs to be concentrating on Norway and not worrying about these other that's people. That's very true. And here on the left side of your screen, you can see Tracy Smothers sneaking out here now. I don't know what he's doing here. Carl doesn't see him. Preoccupied with Norway over there, got him locked into a, a wrist lock there, kind of with the fingers and a boot to the stomach. Shooting him off. Gets reversed right into a forearm from Tracy, right to the back of the head. Norey grabs him, there's the chopping block. This is where Norey excels, look at this. Not only does he go for the pin, hooks the leg, hooks both legs, and he gets...